We're going to learn some Likuti Alachis from Hilchus Kriyashma, Gimel Dalit. It says in the Pasik, Zos HaTorah Adam. This is the Torah Adam. And there's a lot of discussion. A man is only Torah. That's what he's about. That's what it means. So Rav Nassim has his own explanation of what this, what, how do we explain this? The Torah is Adam. What does that mean? She said, Kishimukayim Metzramach Mitzvah HaTorah. When a person fulfills the 248 mitzvahs of the Torah, Az Nikroin Adam, then you're called Adam. That's an Adam. Adam, if someone has a real level of Adam, that's a person who keeps the Torah. Ki im lav chas v'shon. Kamosh kos, like it says, Zos Torah Adam, like it says, this is the Torah Adam. Ki im lav chas v'shon. Because if you're not chas v'shon, hurak chaya bedmus Adam. Of course, this is only in how he is here. Like it says, it's external, his external self, his internal self, it's irrelevant. But really, he's now the Gashmins took over, he's like any animal in a certain way. It's famous, the, the, right, the, the Rebbe Melech, was a, there was a steer merchant, and the guy came into his room in the attic, he walked in this little this room, he went up this leg, very thin ladder, and the Rebbe Melech looked at him, he's like, how did this ox get in here? How did this steer, the guy looked, he's the Gemara and Shabbos really, it's the person who's not Zeicha, so he has he, he takes on a, the animals aren't afraid of him. He takes on a, a the moose like a kind of uh, it doesn't mean he actually resembles one, but he has, doesn't have the shmira of someone who's connected to Hashem. When you connect to Hashem, there's no such thing. There's no such thing as as the, the big the gross yidden who are really connected. They have a, a, a shmira that's hard to even give over. I can just say a story about the Rambam Kodesh. The Rambam Kodesh was one time traveling with the whole caravan. What do you mean by shmira? Okay. Protection from all sorts of difficult things. They must even from wild beasts. Seeing the guy is some sort of an animalistic aura because he's yeah, it's because he's his there. whole life is animals exactly, and they see it. Hmm? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, never, never. I never, never. No, it's the people, the people. But the uh, the uh, the so. The, you know, the Orchama Kodesh was once in a caravan with a whole bunch of Jews and non-Jews and they were going oh, and there was a pride of lions it wasn't that big there was a pride of lions there was a whole bunch of lions came and they were attacking the caravan it's not usual but sometimes when the lions are very hungry they can attack people out in the desert or wherever they were in the wilderness so the Orchama Kodesh got up he walked over to this, this big one of the big lions the main lion and he just to show the thing it's bris mm-hmm. and they all fled his bris? yeah yep. yeah his bris and it ran mm-hmm. it left so there was Epicene Mom there, there was an Arabian Mom, he said, Oh, Skula! We learned a Skula! So once he was in the caravan, he tried it, and his results were not so <laughs> pleasant. But actually, it's like, the, this is the thing with Sadiq, that you can have the beard, you can have the, the, the kafia, but like, buddy, if you don't have the Ketusha, don't try this at home. <laughs> you, know, you know, don't try this when you're in trouble. Not going to work so well. And it's like, this is the thing, when you have the Ketusha, the Rukhara Kodesh had the Ketusha, so it's not, it's completely, there's no, there's no problem. The people, they, they were so connected, there's, there's no problem. There's another story with the Rukhara Kodesh that he one time, um, he one time, the Rukhara Kodesh, he one time, he was a gem cutter. He, he did different things, so there was one, the king wanted garments sewn with, uh, with his, uh, with his, uh, he's very, very skilled for his daughter's wedding. Sewn these garments, these gems, or whatever, it was prepared for the, for the garment, for the, for the garments for his daughter's wedding. So the Chaim Kodesh is like, listen, I only work as much money I need to make as much money as I need for, to make my monthly bills. Then I'm done. I don't work. Then I just serve Hashem until next month. Mm-hmm. So I can finish this in like three, four months. And they're like, oh no, the, the, the king's daughter's wedding is in one month. And you'll finish it this month or you will not be a long-lived person. You will better have your will and testament in order because someone who doesn't want to listen to the king is not a problem. He has, um, he has ways of dealing with him so he doesn't have to confront him again. The Chaim is like, Whatever you say. And they came. And he's like, no, no, I, like I said, I did exactly, <laughs> he did exactly this one. Yeah, can you leave the money for the for this pr- part now? They left it again. And it's like, you know. So they came and like, what are you, crazy? This is like capital punishment. The king told you, you have to do it. He's like, whatever you say. He's like, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll throw you to lions. And, um, you know, so he's like, okay, just a minute. I have to get my talisman film, a book or two, and whatever you say. Like, you, this guy's a nutcase. Whatever, this is the rule. <laughs> so they take the, the, the this stuff. His wife's like, where are you going? He's like, nowhere, I'll be back. I'm like, totally, you know, totally, completely. And he walks, they put in the pride of lions, and they're, you know, they're hungry, and nothing. Usually there's roaring, and there's naming, tearing sounds when someone's doing in there. Nothing. What's going on? So the lion keeps, like, looking. He sees the Rechamukar, he's sitting there saying to him, and the lion's all sitting around him. 
And the kid's like, oh, no, I'm so sorry, holy man. You know, like, like it becomes like the thing, like, you know what I mean? Don't try this at so, all. Exactly. This is not where we are holy. It's a person who's like Don't absolutely tachlis, completely connected. He's who knows what. These people are, 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 are on the highest level. So wonderful. But like the, the bottom line is what you have to understand that real Adam, this is what you tell telling Adam, that's what we're here for. Purpose. You want to get to your purpose. You need to do mitzvahs. That's the way you connect to Hashem. This is the main Rahmanis. There should be people here. We should be people. And everyone to be people, a person become a human being. This is like what life's about. A person has to feel awe, oh, feel a kedusha, have to feel a connection. That's what we're here for. We're not here for anything else. When there's all this other stuff, the gosh, it's not the real us at all. It's not bring it. It's like some other animal. You're a little smarter animal, two legged animal. That's not true. Your premium is connected. There's no such thing as losing it. Your premium is always like you can do anything you want to do. Bottom line is, you're the same male, you will still wake up in the morning. You don't say, Well, when I, do I say the kind of show should start to be Tahiri? Uh, my say, Do I say Shlosh to Nigai? You know what I acted like yesterday? No, that wasn't a guy. So the, the way that Rizal says, he says, No, you say these brachas because you didn't get the Nisham of the Nefesh of a guy in you. And if you could say the brachas, which Diamond says, that means no matter what, you say the brachas today, you can't be, you have a Nefesh of a guy in you. End of Akaza. Cannot be. You have a Nefesh of a Jew. You can't be. Never place to Can't be. You have an effort of a, of a Jew. A real Jew. That's the way it is. Doesn't matter. No one's a check. Well, let's see. Let's give you the checklist. Do you pronounce film? Did you this? Did you that? What'd you eat? What'd you do? What do you think? What do you watch? What'd you, oh, one, one minute. Let's let's make it. There's no evaluation. It doesn't make any difference. It's a lot of dirt. You never got a lot of dirt. You gotta clean up the dirt. But the bottom line is, you go to the dirt, you can clean it up. But you have net nitzchias. You're a net side. Like a dime. You drop a dime in the mud. You throw it out. And of course not. There are moxes. Diamond, you don't throw it out. You clean it. You have to clean it one way or the other. You still a diamond. Still priceless. Every mitzvah is still priceless. It's worth all the all the various in the world. It's worth a million times more. Because it's for netzach and the various to take time and the shmut to get rid of them. Not gishmak. Not gishmak. What can you do? Hopefully you threw two of it. If not, there are other ways. How is it a person that let's say is born a Jew, but there's no way, almost certainly in his whole life, that he'll ever become religious? Let's That's a great a, question. In the midst of America. And That's a great like, question. It's got its own complex answer which of course boils down to really really have no idea but Hashem is running the show he knows what he's doing but there is what to say about it but I don't know if like we're supposed to finish in three minutes look at the left I'm going to try and then maybe we'll deal with the question in another minute so but it's a great question what about people what do you mean? he doesn't have a chance he doesn't have a chance of a snowball in the furnace how is he supposed to make it he can't make it good question so that's the main Rachmanis that therefore Shema which is a revelation of godliness in the world, which is the main Rachmanis. Through the midst of we reveal godliness, reveal Hashem. Right, Kanal? There are 248 words in Kriyashma, either with Kel Mechanaman or Hashem Lakechem Emes. Right, one or the other. So when you don't have a minion, you don't say Hashem Lakechem Emes, you say Kel Mechanaman before. If not, you hear what the minion, you have to hear the Hashem Lakechem Emes to finish off the Ramach, the 248. Um, these 248 words, which correspond to 248 positive commandments, right? This is the aspect of purifying your 248 limbs of your, of your own. Because that's the main Rachmanis. And Rabbi Nassim adds, right? Ramach, Ramach, 248. When you spell 248, Ramach, like it is in Chazal, what does Ramach, if you flip around the order a little bit, spell? Rachem. Also Ramach. Great. Oh, that was good. Excellent. Very good. I forgot that. That it says in the that the Zayar says. One second. That's something different and very, very good. It's a Romach to destroy the other side. And it's Rachim, because it's the main Rachmanis. And a person who's not doing it, he reveals something called Khairim, which is not so good. He's Nechra, he's like he's put away from Hashem. You're supposed to do them and not avoid that. It has all these potential things. This is the bottom line. Or uh, for to, or to the Sainim, we have a Machrim, one or the other. So, yes, but very good. Thank you. I forgot that that uh, Indian, which is the Zayar Mamish. The Chomer is also true. Yeah, you have to. Either you're in Chomer or, or, or you pick up the Chomer. The mitzvahs are in Chomer, but they pick up the Chomer. The 248. 248 positive commandments. Chomer also means wine. Which means you'll you, you get to a place of the initial Torah, you get to a place of his Galus. What? Kel Melech Leave it. Because there's a reason why. There's a, there's a reason why. Because either you're supposed to dive on the minion, or there's a way of be revealing those three little three words with different kavanas in Bayatza Benachem. Emes. Or some sort of the the this is Krishna Lamina. Yeah. Huh? 
Maybe he does say, I don't know. Yeah, uh, that may be why. I don't know. Let's 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 finish this off because we're timing out. Suddenly, what do we say before Shema? Rachim, Rachim, Rachim. What's this Rachim? It's the whole Shema is Rachim. So we're preparing. Merciful Father, have Rachmanis, because all about Rachmanis, connecting to the mitzvahs and doing the mitzvahs. The main Rachmanis is to know Hashem and do his mitzvahs. Anything else is not Rachmanis. There's nothing there. The Medrash says, another line story, the Medrash says was a guy who found something that was able to, to uh, revive the dead, and he's stupid, he has no das, if someone has no das, you can't have Rachmanis on them. So he was stupid, he saw a dead line, he put it on, oh, it works, the thing ate him. It's the same thing, person, you have to have Rachmanis. There's Rachmanis and Rachmanis. Well, he had a thing that could revive the dead. It's a medrash. I don't know if it's a true. We never know whether the medrash is true or not. We don't know. But it doesn't matter. Point is, you have no Rachmanis. You're going to destroy the whole world. You think you're Rachmanis. If you have inappropriate Rachmanis, you're going to have Achzarius. That's what Chazal said. Shaul had, had uh, Rachmanis on so Nagag. He had, uh, had Achzarius. Yeah, exactly. Yes. The Rabbi says this, about this idea very much, for sure. And it's a very important idea. But Rav is expanding on this concept to be on the to realize. I want to have Rachmanis. Rachmanis is Ramach and Romach also. You're right. So breaking the other side and build, building up your Amunu, your connection to Hashem. That's what Rachmanis is about. Dealing with the Chomer, uplifting the Chomer, all of these things, all these Reish Ches Mem, that's what Rachmanis is. That's what Rachim is. It's not about all other things, Rachmanis. Oh, I'll just stay in bed. Oh, I'll just this. Because people have a mis- misplaced Rachmanis. How is it taking pity on yourself? Because that is the purpose of life. That's what we're here for. And that is a revelation. Like when you, when you leave the world, you're going to have like. Um, you have like a whole a whole map of these, all these blips, these light blips. That's what you're doing. That's what you're doing to go mitzvah. Going to mitzvah. That's what you're doing to mitzvah. That's what the, the, the going famously says, din v'cheshmen. There'll be a din. What'd you do wrong when you were doing that? Very and a cheshmen, why were you doing good? He said, the cheshmen's harder. Why don't you do good? That's eternity. Eternity. Tzitzis. A few pennies. It's kind of there's life. A few pennies. Tzitzis. Can't do that. You leave this world. Now you can do it. So it's, it's every drop is tremendous. Every lesson is every good point. You have to be so happy and so thankful. Like you won the lottery, Mamish. Every good point. Every feeling it. You're working on it. We're working on it. We are working on it. It's plugged into that reality. We have to, every, yes, we have to learn how to every, do it. Every, every vein in it, every vein in it. Yes, blood. that's right. Every drop of blood. But if we aspire to it and we speak about it, we learn about it, we'll get to it. That's the rule. What possibly? What was the... What was the it's the Adam, right? Uh, those Torah, those Torah Adam. Adam is a Torah, because that's exactly. the Adam Ramah. Exactly, Ramnasen, his Ramah, and we're close But you could do it too. This. Someone said Ramnasen once told somebody, he was told somebody, he was going to, we're a little over time, okay, it's life. He once told somebody, we're going to, he said, I'm going somewhere, he said, you should travel, you should know, just like Yaakovinu, the guy stopped him. He's like, Yaakovinu, you're comparing me to Yaakovinu. Yaakovinu was like one of the, Bechira of us, the highest level, he was in Makov, the Shechina, uh, Officer of Nasser's hand in him, I covered him, Mamash would cover these, these, these obviously. Yaakov was the highest, standing on the shoulders of Avon Yitzchak. I'm compared. So Nasser's like, I'm sorry, my friend, I didn't mean to say you're the same as him, but you also, everything you do is also tikkunim. Don't say it's only Yaakov. No, what you do is also tikkunim. And if you mess up, you messed up. But everything you do, you can't, it's all being sent to where it's supposed to go and going into the base of Midrash. You can't remove that. You did, you did, it's forever. It's got an eternity. So we're also yeah, we're also like Rav we're also like these tzaddik. We just have to do our best, and work, and yearn, and aspire, and we'll get there. That's the